Hey guys, it's Ted with another Sunday here on 7SOGs. Yeah, so I took a week off. Sorry. I'm back. And uh, let's get into these questions. Becky, you asked, what is your favorite home-cooked meal? Um, I had to think really hard about this because both my parents are like such good cooks. Um, I had a really hard time picking, but my favorite is probably this little dish that my dad makes. Um, and, um, basically it's like really fatty, juicy slices of pork in over a bowl of rice and it's just seasoned really well. <laughs> and we call it fun and ro ro. And I'm, I'm embarrassed to like say that because that is like Mandarin Chinese for rice and meat. And because my Chinese is not really that great, I'm not really sure if that's like an actual name of the dish, that like you just refer to it as rice and meat, or if that is just like baby talk Chinese that my parents use for my benefit and we just started saying that around the house, so that's just what we call it. I don't actually know. So if there are any Chinese speakers out there, I don't know. I just let me know. <laughs> fun, fun and fun and ro ro. Well, that's actually Chinese and English because there's a there's an English and in their fun being rice ro 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 being meat. Anyway, that's what it is. I think it's really funny that um you guys listed like meatloaf. I don't think I've ever eaten meatloaf at home. I don't think my parents even know how to cook it. Like for me, growing up in an Asian household, meatloaf was like some magical dish that families on TV ate. Like, I never knew what it was until I ate it um, at a friend's house once. And it was pretty good. I just never had it at home. So. Then you asked, what's our favorite language? And I guess the easy answer would be Japanese, just because I spent so much time and effort learning it. But I thought about it, and I actually really like watching people speak sign language. Like, I mean, no, it's signing. I, I, I don't know, have you guys ever like paid attention to someone who's, to two people but who are like really like fluent in sign language? It's just There's something so rhythmical and, I don't know, unique about it. Like I just love watching it. I think it's really cool. Uh, Greg, you asked, can you be friends with your ex? Um, sure, why not? I mean, I think in a lot of cases, depending on the circumstances of the breakup, it can be really difficult. Categorically, there's nothing that would like prevent said friendships <clears throat> from happening, right? Um, I think I'm friends with most of my exes. Ryan, you asked, what do we do for Christmas? Um, I go home for Christmas. I go home to Ohio. It doesn't matter where I am. If I'm in, uh, when I was in St. Louis for university, when I've been in Japan for not university. Um, I always fly back to Ohio. Like Christmas time is family time. And um, my sister will always bring back like her Home Alone DVD and she'll get really excited about watching it and then we'll end up like not watching it. And then we have a Christmas dinner with our cousins and um, yeah, no, we open Christmas presents on Christmas morning, not at midnight on Christmas Eve. It's cheating. Which my parents used to let me do when I was really young because I was just a jerk <laughs> and I would whine until I got presents. But now I know better. And you should too. No, um, that's just that, uh, how it is in our family. Um, I think that's it. Food, presents talking about and then not watching Home Alone. Yeah, that sums it up. Peter, you asked us, what is the song that makes you stop? I don't really have one. Um, I don't really have one, yeah. Usually I'm listening to my iPod shuffle anyway, so I wouldn't like hear a song playing that makes me stop. Yeah, right, and Guy, you, did you ask? A question? I don't. And I, I don't think you asked a question. Did you? I don't know. Um, 
still waiting for that unedited video you promised me. Which I actually forgot about until you mentioned it in your video, so I thought to you. Yep, anyway, so as you guys can see, I just got back from work. Got in the house. First thing I did, take off my pants. Yeah. My question for you guys this week, what is the first thing you do when you get in the house? See you guys next week.